in the prime. That's why when I said, when when people ask me, from like a, a standpoint of what game is harder, I say. I do say like compared to CS, I think Valorant make like uh. Uh, what is it called? Strategically is a harder game, and it's just because there's literally like so much bullshit they have to put up with, and there's like so many wrong ways that you can play it or right ways you can play it based off of like the enemy team's like alt orbs or the enemy team's abilities and what they have left it's like very very like every round is like adapting to something whereas like cs is very like more more cookie cutter it's not like you it's not that you can't improvise but it's more cookie cutter but from a mechanical standpoint cs is a lot harder but because of that then valorant becomes like the overall harder game because of like the strategy is outweighing the gunplay way more yeah, the meta changes constantly. And that's also why in Valorant, it's so hard for teams to uh, always win. I I don't really know if Valorant will ever have like a true dynasty in a sense. I think there'll be like, like maybe like a few tournaments, like one team might have like the upper hand, but then I think overall to be like the best team for years on end, I don't, I don't think it's possible in this game. To be completely honest, I think um, <laughs> mentally it's very draining playing this game a lot, and it's always like adapting. Yeah, a really yeah, was, a really cracked CS player is not dying to a CS noob, but like a, a fucking God's gift to Valorant can still die to like a gold player, just because the gold player had a result. <laughs> <laughs> 